Hello, everybody. Today, I'm just... Oh, my God. Okay, turned off the audio. Anyway, like I was saying, today, we're... I'm gonna be playing this parkour game while just, you know, talking about stuff. I'm trying to sit up greatly, but it's not working. I also don't have a mic, so... Yeah... I'm, I'm not super good at these games, but I'm okay at them. I say while I'm literally almost not, well, literally not dying. Okay, okay, blah, 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 blah. okay. Uh, so I guess what I want to talk about is mainly, I just hope oh, my upload schedule. I guess, yeah. Let's, well, I'll talk about for right now. So basically. How my upload schedule is going to be working is I'm just going to, like, post a video telling you guys what I'm going to post. And then I'm going to post that video maybe when I'm finished with it. And then if I don't, if I decide it won't, it's a failed project, I will make a video and say, Hey, I'm not posting this video anymore. It's a project I decided not to make. So, yeah. I am actually working on a project at the moment. It's a, um animation actually it's taking me forever and yes the art is like basically from gotcha but i change it up a little bit you know just to make it look more nice and smooth um it's a it's it's called hot milk it's one of those old animation memes that people used to do a whole bunch except i'm doing it with moon and he uh He's going to be real fun to animate. I, I'm telling you that. God, I don't want to do that. But I'm going to have to. <laughs> anyway. I usually don't animate. Because, like, it takes forever. So I usually just settle with animating on Gotcha. But I decided, hey, I want to do, like, a home-drawn anime. Uh, anim anime? Animation. <laughs> Not anime, what? I'm not making an anime, what? <laughs> but, yeah, I wanted to make my own animation, and I'm really excited to post it and stuff. Because, you know, it's gonna be fun. My nose is very stuffy. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna... Do you think I could... <laughs> I'm gonna confuse people. I died. <laughs> I died. Oh well. I already reached the end anyway. So I'm about extra time. You better hurry. You, you better hurry. I feel like... Oh my... You better spawn. Okay, good. Wee! Oh... Didn't even click that. But. <laughs> okay. That just proves how big. <laughs> oh jeez. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Oh Louise. Wait. <laughs> uh. So um. How's your day been? Mine's been. Boring. <laughs> Cause. Actually, I kind of had nothing to do except make videos for a while because most of my friends have, like, stuff to do because, uh, I don't know. Most of them don't tell me what they have to do, which is kind of suspicious. Are you guys selling drugs? <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> I don't think you guys are selling drugs. Well, maybe one of you, Jade. <clears throat> Jade, what kind of crack go okay. <laughs> Carmen, you too. Also, you, Jen. I'm, I'm watching you. <laughs> you definitely selling some crack. With how terrible your upload schedule has been on TikTok. Ma'am. <laughs> She's literally posted one thing. <laughs> well, I want to, I actually kind of want to look at her profile a little later and be like, hmm, I wonder how many followers she has. It's going to be like, three or something that'd be real funny i should actually check that later but yeah 
so basically about my upload schedule not my friends uh but mine i like i said i'm just gonna upload when i feel like it and i'll post a video telling you guys what i'm gonna upload talking about it and stuff i'm i'm thinking about doing a sketchbook review of me from second to third maybe Um, but yeah. Anyway. Uh, I don't really know what I'm doing. Um, this is awkward because I don't know how to, you know, do commentary or anything. Because I suck. But, yeah, I'm just... <laughs> I don't know. But, yeah. Basically, I've been working on a whole, whole bunch of stuff. So, it's been kind of like stopped up but i will tell you a few gotcha things that i'm making one of them is uh gonna be a sans au gotcha series that's an original one it's gonna be centered around direction and his team and stuff like that and then there's another one i'm gonna post soon it's gonna be like basically if direction chose to be evil instead of you know realizing how bad someone can be and being like you know what I don't want to be that way and then being good you know you guys know what I'm talking about but anyway I'm gonna be making those and the series I was just talking about I'm not gonna tell you what it's called yet I'll make an entire video explained on that I don't feel like doing commentary on that because people in my household are subscribed to me as well and I don't want them having spoilers oh <laughs> Well, I just died. Because I suck at this game. Even though I was literally in third place last round. We don't talk... We don't talk about that. Oh my god, I hate this so much. I hate this one so much. Bro. Literally can't stand it. No. I don't... I don't like that. Okay, okay. Should be able to make it here. But, yeah. Basically, my upload schedule is gonna be mostly filled with, like, Undertale stuff. But I might make some Happy Tree Friends stuff. I don't know. I might even start making my original series. I have two that I'm planning on making at the moment. One of them is called the Black Rose Mafia. It, it's, it's literally just, it's not a love story or anything. I'm just going to tell you that right now. It has a lot of blood in it. And it's, it's not going to be like one of those love story ones where it's like a guy and a girl meet up or like two boys or two girls. No, 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 no. It will have love in it, but it won't be like the center of attention. I'm just saying. It will have, like, mostly them doing investigations, and it will mostly be, like, a mystery thing. It'll be kind of like, um, uh, I don't know, actually. I don't remember what it's called, but it, it'll be some, it would be, like, one of those, uh, shows where police investigate things, and it's, like, a mystery show where, like, uh, like, Stranger Things or something. <laughs> it'll be, it's... Not really like Stranger Things. More like Gravity Falls, maybe. Oh yeah, and my Gravity Falls series. I forgot to explain about that. I will be making more episodes of that soon. Not not now, but soon. Definitely not now, though. Because like, I'm working on too much stuff for it to be now. But anyway, pretty sure I'm the third person. Yep. Oh, eighth person. <laughs> But anyway, yeah, I will be uploading stuff like that soon. I might even start uploading my original FNAF series. It'll be centered on my uh, FNAF uh, original characters. Um, and no, none of them are me. I'm, I'm just saying that right now. None of them are me. I'm not one of those people who inserts themselves into a fandom. Even though I've done that like one time. <laughs> I did that one time with Happy Tree Friends. I was like a red wolf in it. It was actually not that bad. And, but I was like six and it was cringy. 
I was like six, and it was like, you know those videos people make of like the Owl House OCs, and like POV that one cringe six year old makes a Owl House OC. Yeah, that's basically what I was. <laughs> Except like, <laughs> instead of Owl House characters, it was like Happy Tree Friend characters. I wasn't actually six. I was probably like ten. <laughs> Which isn't actually that long ago, if you really think about it. It would be like three years ago. Wait. <laughs> I shouldn't be saying my age. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Half the audience already knows my age anyway. Well, m most of it. Not half. But most of it. Um, also, I will be maybe making some more Happy Tree Friend content. I don't know. Maybe not. Probably not. I don't really feel like it. I might make some more music videos if I really feel like it, but I don't think I will be doing that. Mainly because, like, I don't know, it's just... It's a lot of work that goes in the music videos, and you guys seem to like my drawings more than my music videos and stuff like that. But I'm completely okay with you guys liking it more. I enjoy doing art more than the music videos. Well, yeah, I enjoy doing art more. Also, I will, I did make a new Sans. I posted it on my TikTok. Um, his name is Newsprint Sans. He's, like, he looks just like normal Sans, except, you know, he's black and white. Well, he's not black and white. He's, like, gray, gray and white. He has some purple on him, too, but that's... That was just for aesthetic purposes in the drawing. He, he, in reality, he would just be black and white, and his satchel would just be brown and yellow. Those are the only colors he would have on him. Because, you know, newsprint is usually black and white and gray and stuff. At least it was, I, th I think it is. I'm not sure, I haven't seen a newspaper in a while. Because, like, no one reads them anymore. <laughs> but... Yeah, I, I guess, yeah, yeah, he's, um, he's, I didn't give him, like, a tragic backstory or anything like I did with Direction. I just kind of made him, like, a generic Sans, you know, kind of like, just, you know, Sans, but newsprint. He's a, he's a newspaper boy. He, actually, he's a type, uh, he, uh, works in a newspaper place. He does the typing and he, like, prints out the papers and stuff, which is not, well, thus the name newsprint. And he is based off in the early 2000s, and Direction is based off the 1920s through 30s, I think. I think. No, it's not 30s and 20s. It's the 1930s through 40s. Uh, yeah. He's, um, the reason I say that is because, like, you know, he is, he's just really old school. He also, um, I don't know why, but I always make my characters have, like, some sort of tragic backstory. <laughs> like, it can be, like, any character you see. Like, every single character either has no dad, no mom, no family, an unstable mental, like, situation. Or, like, my boyfriend cheated on me, or something like that. So I became a lesbian. <laughs> Bro, I've seen so many gotcha videos of that. Like, it's like, my girlfriend cheated on me, so I'm gonna be gay. <laughs> or it's like, my boyfriend cheated on me, so I'm gonna like women instead. It's so dumb. It, I think that's called bisexual. Oh. I was itchy and it, like... Anyway, like I was saying, it, it's so ridiculous. I love it, though. It's so funny. <sighs> oh, my God. The reason I just sighed like that is because I was holding my breath. And also because I've been talking, like, a whole bunch. So, yeah. Um... But, yeah, I've basically been seeing a whole bunch of, like, new gotcha trends that I have not done for multiple reasons. For one, I don't have the time. <laughs> and for two, I just don't feel like it. 
because like I don't have the time for it because I've been making so many series and so many like you know new things and I've been trying to make more Sansas that don't exist yet because like well not just Sansas like I'm adding the entire AU not just the Sans um a lot of people just make the Sans and don't make their AU I've noticed that and or people make new Sansas as ship children uh, take Blueprint, for example. He's he's not his own Sans. He's, he, he's a ship child. Uh, take, like, Pastel or Palette, for example. They're both ship children. And Gradient and Paper Jam, too. They're ship children as well. Which, I think I should start making, like those kind of characters if they weren't ship children because I think they would look very different if they weren't please touched it <laughs> um but yeah if they weren't ship children I'm pretty sure they would look extremely different at least from my view and um I've been really wanting to make those and to just like you know, normal Sansas instead of ship children, you know? Even though there's already a Sans for it, I, I think I might actually end up doing that. I've also been trying to do different variations of, like, foods into Sansas, because i noticed not all foods have gotten a Sans yet, which is sad. My favorite candy, Sour Patch Kids, they didn't have a Sans until I created it. I've actually seen a Patch Sans, which actually is pretty cool. Love the Patch Sans. But, yeah. Anyway. I... I... Don't know what to say, actually. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna be creating more of them. I've already created a whole bunch of Sanses. Me and my friend are gonna be making series on the Gem and Sanses soon. It's not the Crystal Gems. I swear, if someone comments Steven Universe on that, I will literally hunt you down and give you a high five. <laughs> In the face. So basically, I'm going to slap you. Yeah? No, that's just a face palm, but with someone else's hand. That makes sense, right? <laughs> it makes sense, right? Please tell me it makes sense. It doesn't make sense, does it? Well, anyway. I'm bonking my head on that. <sighs> oh my god, I can't talk so much. <laughs> anyway, yeah. I personally could literally sit here and talk all day. I'm not joking. I could just talk about everything. So basically, I want to talk about my Legend of the Waterfall series. My friend uh, Jen, she already made... Uh, well, her name's actually Jennifer. I just call her Jen for short. But she made a TikTok on um, that. I told her about it and she was like, Hey, can I make the first episode pilot for it? And I was like, Sure. And she made the gotcha version of it, and I think you, it actually was pretty good. Um, she didn't like, I don't think she included anyone being shipped in it, which is why I really liked it. Because in the first episode, I, I told her all about the first episode. The first episode is just basically uh, the first, main two characters, um, who are Diana and Jade, they're twin sisters. And um, they were created by their older sister. Uh, not, she didn't give birth to them. She literally created them from her DNA. So, and, uh, so they're not her children. They're her sisters. It, it's kind of weird. I, I'll, I'll explain more about that later. It'll make more sense once I actually make the real first episode and stuff like that. She also had all the character designs basically perfect. Except, I think she whitewashed one of the characters on accident. Because one of the characters was white when they're supposed to be um, a darker skin tone than white. I think it was one of the Egyptians. Because um, there is Egyptians in it. Uh, they ran away from their home because they're both, they didn't want to... The older sister didn't want to get married and the younger sister wanted to go with her. Their names are Charlie and Maria. And uh, they're supposed to be like a darker skin tone because they're, you know, Egyptian. And Egyptians are, um, well, I'm, I'm saying, like, 
usually they're like a darker skin tone because they live in like a warmer region oh, <laughs> they live in a warmer region and um yeah usually they're a darker skin tone like a tan maybe and that's why i made them like a tan color uh, because also because it looks better in their character design and um i actually like the characters i'd say my favorite one of the both of them is maria because she is like great and less annoying um char uh charlie her si her younger sister they aren't actually biological sisters they were both adopted just so you know um basically the first episode is just diana and jade being uh going to their first day of school um and uh their cousin is the one showing them around the school his name is ian and he like shows them around the school and stuff and rem reminder this is like a a mythical kind of thing uh it's like fairy tale like but every single fairy tale in it is basically flawed it's kind of like shrek where like fairy tales are just like you know irrelevant but yeah the uh they're all fairy tale creatures and stuff like diana and jade they're both like um diana is a guardian angel and then jade is like a dark angel you know and then their older sister is like a half angel demon thing hybrid i don't know i don't know at all <laughs> and then most they're i'm gonna name everyone in their friend group so um the first friend i'm gonna name that i haven't named yet uh his name is jack he is a werewolf i guess um and no do not even think about saying oh is there gonna be like markings in this they have alpha marks you can't transfer the alpha marks unless you're stupid <laughs> you can't do that no 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 no. i defy yeah gotcha logic in that but yeah basically you um he's an alpha he's a death alpha he's basically the grim Re reaper for werewolves makes sense yeah he's also the worst <laughs> he's extremely rude he has a twin brother named jackson though who is a werewolf of love don't even think about saying cupid werewolf or like something like that because that's exactly what it is but that's my job to introduce it but yeah that's it that's it for those two but um diana uh diana's personal best friend uh his name is coral he is an emotion werewolf he is it's not an alpha or anything it's like freaking a werewolf that it's kind of like those mini movies where like the girl is able to where you can like basically her hair or her eyes change colors based off her emotion or something like that well that's coral except he um at the, well in the like first like episode season i guess you could say of the series he will only reflect sadness um the reason why is because he's depressed <laughs> no joking it's because he's emo <laughs> but anyway uh and then there's ian their cousin he is a vampire and he sucks no i'm joking he's actually really nice in season one season two it's where he's like terrible <laughs> but um then there's uh i forgot i forgot their name her name is it's something with an m and she's like a freaking cat lady literally a cat lady not not like she has a bunch of cats she's literally a freaking half cat but but she is like extremely like headstrong she would literally beat somebody up if they ever said like 
hey, are you, <laughs> like, so, just something stupid. If anyone said, ever said, like, something stupid, like, I don't know, just something stupid in general, she would literally be like, uh, probably beat them up. She is very, very aggressive. Also, I will be, uh, showing the character designs for them later. I'll post a video on it. I'll post a video of showing off all their character designs and stuff like that. There's also, uh, three more people, four more people in the group. There's an, uh, there's another royal group that lives in the area other than Diana and Jade. Um, and Ian, of course. And, uh, they're, they're, ba I think, I forgot what they're called. I forgot their last names and I literally created them. Uh, freak, I forgot their names. Whatever, we're gonna skip them for right now. There's this girl named Gold. Um, her name's Gold. She... Uh, she has, like, a villain arc and stuff, and ends up being, um, like, good in the end and stuff like that. Don't worry about it. And if, uh, warning, this vo video will be spoiling some of the stuff that happens in the series. So if you don't want a spoiler or, like, anything like that, you can just, like, click off the video. But anyway, like I was saying, Goldie, uh, her, or not Goldie. God, that's a nickname that someone calls her. It, he's like a water alpha thing. He's like the worst. Um, he's really rude and sucks, but he calls he calls her Goldilocks for obvious reasons. But her name is Gold, and uh, her name's Gold Maxson. She has an older sister named Rachel, who is one of the heroes of the town, and Rachel also sucks. <laughs> Uh, Rachel is kind of, like, mean, though. She, like, she, <laughs> she, uh, she's really stuck up, and she doesn't like people. <laughs> That's all I can say. She's stuck up and doesn't like people. She also, uh, she's not that bad, but she, like, she may, uh, she, <laughs> she freaking bully, uh, like, used to bully a uh, six like a uh, someone I don't remember the name I forgot their name I forgot I forgot my own characters that I created as a name well yeah she bullied uh people in school when she was younger and she also is kind of rude but I don't she oh yeah she doesn't realize that she's rude until like a different season <laughs> where Goldie has her. Uh, or, oh my god, I keep calling her Goldie because for he, I keep thinking of Goldilocks. <laughs> Bro, my brother called me Goldilocks when I uh, got my, like, the bottom half of my hair highlighted. He was like, yo, what's up, Goldilocks? Excuse me. <laughs> but, yeah. How long has this recording been going for? Because I'm about to make another video. <laughs> You know what? I'm just gonna make an 